I'll, I'll tell you, one of the big things and big mistakes that a lot of authors make is that they write the book first and then try to build a following. Mm. One of the big things that we did early on is we used articles, we used our network, we cultivated a, a list of people before we launched the book. So we had a list of 10,000 names before the book ever came out wow. that, that understood that we were credible people and that wanted to take advantage of that. So you go to a publisher and you say, hey, I've got 10,000 people I can sell this book to right now. They, they, they listen. Because one of the things they're looking for, and everyone is looking for, is a turnkey model. They don't want to do any work. So if they already see that you have a following and they can just put either greater distribution behind that mm -hmm. model or they can put some marketing dollars behind it, which most publishers don't, but right. other aspects. <laughs> but it definitely goes back to having the coaching to understand mm -hmm. what are the right things to do and then make sure that you do have a team such as, let's say, a publicist who can get you booked on different right. shows. That way you're not wasting your time doing media follow-up, but you're focused on your craft and becoming a better writer and so forth. Even outside of publishing, most people are operating their business at a scale which, is just, which just does not work. So you have to scale the business initially. You have to design it with the idea that I am going to have enough products and services that I can sell to people to generate the revenue so that I can hire a publicist, so that I can pay for different marketing vehicles. A lot of people do it backwards. They want to come out with one book. But let's say you have one book and it sells for anywhere 12 to $20, but it costs you $500 or $1,000 to go to an event to promote it. It doesn't, the math just doesn't work out. So you have to think about some ways in which you can create additional products and services. One great way that you can instantly do it is by doing product swaps with other friends who write mm. books. So if you have a book that's at a similar price point, you say, I'll swap a case of your books for a case of mine, particularly if they're in similar genres and it would appeal to a similar audience. And you do that two or three times. When you go out to an event, you now have four or five books that you can sell. So you've raised, one, the lifetime value of, of the customer because instead of just being able to get 12 to $20, you can now get 100 wow. And then you can implement a lot of back-end services that, such as the coaching, such as the mm -hmm. consulting. And if you have a particular expertise, these are ways in which you can make it more affordable. Right. But realize for us, at least in the Barron program, the book is not the product. The, 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 the actual product or the service are, are the higher end things that we're offering. Excellent. The book just becomes a tool to qualify, to generate interest, and to build that credibility and establish that rapport. This is William R. Patterson, national best-selling co-author of The Barron Sun. I hope you enjoyed the lessons and insights from this brief video clip on the Barron Solution Programs for Wealth and Business Success. I now invite you to complete the information request form in the workshops and coaching section of barronseries.com to learn how you can best leverage the Barron Solution Business and Personal Coaching Program to help dramatically increase your business or personal income. You may also access the coaching information request form directly by typing www.barronseries.com forward slash coaching dot htm in the address field of your web browser now and all you do continued success william r patterson